Hi, my name is Matthew Scott from SHS International. Thank you for joining us today. Um, we're going to be speaking to Marguerite Dietlefs today about homocystinuria. So, Marguerite, can you tell us first of all what exactly is homocystinuria? Homocystinuria is an um, inherited metabolic disorder and it affects a specific amino acid called methionine. Um, homocystinuria is also referred to as HCU. Right. Um, for short. Right, okay. Um, can you just tell me how does a person actually get HCU? Well, it's diagnosed um, around birth um, or in the first few weeks of life, um, but it can also be diagnosed a little bit later. It depends obviously on the country where you are right. and the type of screening that they do. Um, but usually it's it's picked up within infancy. Right, okay, and how is it actually diagnosed? What's the what's the process? A blood test is done and certain enzyme analysis on the blood is done to actually test for and um, the presence of the enzyme that breaks down the methionine. Right, okay, and how do they how do they treat it? Well, generally a person with homocystinuria, there's types of homocystinuria. There's a type which is responsive to a specific vitamin. By, so by treating it with vitamin B6 or pyridoxin, as it's also known, um, the, the condition can actually be managed quite well. Right. But then there's a, there's a um, certain mutation of homocystinuria that um, cannot be that doesn't respond to the vitamin B6 or pyridoxin. And for those patients, generally, they'll have to be on a low protein diet and also take protein substitutes, which is excluding methionine from the diet. Um, they'll have to take that on a regular basis. Right, and if, if someone has HC, is this for life? Will they have to be on this diet for life? Is there? Yes, the diet is, is for life, really. Um, there's no cure for homocysteine right. urea. Um, at this stage um, and the treatment it really is um, a low protein diet um, together with a protein substitute. Right, brilliant. Okay, well thanks for joining us today Marguerite, that was really informative. Thanks Thank a lot. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you.